Okay, let's make sure we have full stamina. Okay, something aggro's on us. But we're gonna finish out this car. The house is just right there. Oh, something aggro on us. Okay, let's go. Welcome back, everybody, to 7 Days to Die on Alpha 20. I'm an old guy gaming, and in this episode, we're going to go back out this afternoon and continue the search for the elusive single mechanical part. Before we get started, if you are interested in hanging out with my awesome gaming community, you can find the link to the Discord down in the description of the video and also in the About section of the YouTube channel. I also do live stream a few times a week. Best thing to do is join up on the Discord, where I will announce when those streams will happen. Okay, let's get started. So uh, I am in good shape food and drink-wise. And we have an additional uh, four more boiled meat uh, that I'm going to keep here at the base for us when we get back. We're going to run back to the trader and sell these two things really quick and then keep searching for that um, uh, that mechanical part because we need it to, to really advance. I decided to drop off my hammer. One less thing to carry. We don't really need to take that with us. Uh, debate whether or not I should take the shovel. But, um, you know, if we, if we run across cobblestone, I want to grab that. So that's why I have the shovel. And if we need to, you know, break something or find some iron along the way or whatever, uh, I'm taking the pick. Okay. Um, maybe, you know what? Actually, I think I'm going to leave the lock picks here too because we're not really looting per se. Uh, at least not, you know, yeah, we're not, we don't need those right now. So I, I have a little bit of a conundrum though because there's a few things I'd like to put on my toolbar, but I can't just because I have all these pipe weapons down here. Um, so I can switch to them quickly without having to reload. So we're kind of just going to have to, you know, switch things around a little bit. I'd like to keep the bow, but we need the axe. want to keep the frames on the toolbar at, at all times. In fact, I'm going to kind of switch those around and put those over here because that's where I'm used to having them. Okay, this is just smelting a few more things. It'll turn off in about a minute and a half, and we'll be good to go. Okay, so let's head on out. Uh, tomorrow is going to be day six, and... Excuse me. Hopefully, we will be able to, at that point, you know, make a wrench and a workbench so we can kind of get started with some stuff with that. But we have to figure out what we're going to do for Horde Night. So I'm not really worried about that until tomorrow. So on day six, that's when we'll concern ourselves with our plan for the first Horde. So let's run over here and sell these things. Uh, you know, I don't think I actually looked at the trader for a wrench. He might have one. Let's see if he has one and how much it costs. Because uh, I, at this point, I'm okay with paying money to buy one if I can afford it, just because we need one pretty desperately at this uh, point in time. All right, so let's sell this to you first and these. Uh, he doesn't want those. He needs them in 10. Okay, we'll just hang on to those. All right, so do you have a wrench, homie? Let's see. He's got the wrench schematic, but we already know that. What about in secret stash? He does not. Okay, doggone it. <clears throat> Excuse me. So, yeah, we're uh, kind of shit out of luck when it comes to the wrench, I guess. Uh, all right. Well, then all we can do is keep looking for... Uh, we need one damn mechanical part. That is all we need is just one, because I have three. And if I can get the one more, um, you know, then we can make a, a, make our own wrench, because I know how to make the wrench. I got the schematic for it. Let's see if we can avoid Mar um, Arlene and head over this way. So in the last episode, if you didn't catch it, we did search to the south. We went into the, the downtown district. Um, and so we're going to kind of head back that way again, but going to stay more to the west side this time. And for now, I'd kind of like to avoid zombies as much as possible. I mean, we do have full health, which is good, but I have no way to heal myself. Um, uh, actually, you know what? I should look at something. Do I have a point? I do. You know what we're going to do at that point? We're going to put that right into healing factor, and that's going to give, give us one health every 90 seconds. So it's just going to boost the... But I heard something. Um, it's going to boost the natural healing um, just a little bit so we can heal a little faster. Okay, I'm not going to take that. But we are going to break that. Uh, these, I guess I've already looted, but let's harvest them because we get more cloth and feathers. 
and grass from doing it. Not that I care so much about the grass, but the other two things I do. Okay, I'm pretty sure I've looted that car. Did we hit this? We did not. Okay. We'll check it anyway, just in case. Uh, there's a rabbit. Okay, so there's more food for us. I figured that would get Darlene's attention. All right, let's just see if we can kill her. She's she's fast. So we want to try and stay ahead of her. Let the bleeds do the work, but we have to mind our stamina too. We do have a couple of beers, so super bad emergency situation. Come on, Dar drop Darlene. Shit. Okay, we didn't quite, we ran out of stamina a little bit, but we're okay. She didn't hit us too hard. Um, all right, did we check this car here? I actually want that. Let's poke our head in here again. I don't know if we went in here or not. I can't remember. There's lots of cobblestone in here that we could get. Nothing up there. Oh, shit! That scared me. <laughs> Fred, cut it out! Fred's not quite as fast as Darlene, so he's not as... He's not going to be as dangerous. We just got to make sure we get solid hits on him. All right, Fred's dead. Fred is dead. We'll take the bone, not the lead. Okay, I'm going to get uh, all this cobble here. Oh, did we harvest our chicken? Or our rabbit. I'm glad I remembered because they'll it'll despawn after a while. I forgot to do it because Darlene attacked us. And Darlene scares me. Uh, yeah, I'll take all that. I'm not going to take those because they're easily made back at the base. Save us a slot. That would have sucked if I would have forgotten to harvest that rabbit. Okay. Let's move out. Checking all the trash because you can get uh, mechanical parts and trash and other things. Okay. We have a couple pieces of uh, corn. We might as well harvest that. Um, I'd grab the chrysanthemum, but we need to conserve space, and that's a little easier to get than corn. Here's a car over here. Oh, that looks like there could be a zombo in there. Nope, looks clear. Okay, unfortunately that's not a lootable car. Yeah, that's just there's to scare the hell out of us. And we got a chicken. Did it spot us? I don't think so. Keep that weapon reloaded, OG. Okay. Keep on, keep it on. Scrap both of those. Okay, we're encumbered by two. We don't need grass, and we don't need that, and we don't need that. Unfortunately, every time we harvest a corpse, we get that shit, but 
Uh, we don't need it. I'm going to keep the stones because we might need them to distract. I should have dropped these back off at the house, but oh well. We'll make the best of it. Okay, we got an Edgar up ahead. There's blueberries in this backyard, or at least there used to be. Yeah, it looks like there still is. We could probably grab enough of those to make it worthwhile. All right, so we got 12 blueberries out of the deal. Let's just eat them now. And there's a workbench in this little shed. I don't... There's an Edgar over there. I don't know if there's a Zombo in there or not. So let's just be prepared. In case there is. Okay, he buggered off. Okay, chance for a mechanical part. Come on, game, please. Damn it, Jim. All right, let's look in here. Those are not mechanical parts. Son of a gun. Okay, well, all we can do is keep looking, my friends. All we can do is keep looking. Um, Let's check. Oh, I thought that was a, a trash bag. Here's a trash bag. Scrap those. Look and see if I have anything I want to get rid of. Uh, you know what? Let's just actually eat these now, too. There's no point in us carrying those around and taking up spots. Oh, is this the motel? That's going to have vending machines. Vending machines and cars. Oh, uh, yeah, let's go around this way. This is an Edgar in there. No, oh, don't want that. Okay. It looks like we're... Oh, shit, there's a wolf right there. I was going to say, it looks like we're reasonably clear around here, but uh, maybe not so much. Okay, let's avoid the wolf. We don't have enough firepower to take a wolf down right now. We're going to poke our head in this garage over here. Okay, we'll sell that. Oh, I think we did this house already. Yeah, this was uh, one one of our last quests. It didn't, doesn't look like I got the cobble, though, so let's grab that. In fact, I think there's more cobble in this house now that I think about it. I don't know that I got all of it. There's not going to be any sleepers in it, so let's just run in and check really quick. Okay, let's continue on here. We're three things in cupboard. Um, don't really want to get rid of anything though, so I'm just gonna have to be three things in cupboard.
There we go. That's what we needed. Okay. We are we're in good shape now. All right, let's head back to the house. And we need to make a wrench, and then we need to use that wrench to get enough mechanical parts to make a second wrench and a workbench. Nice. That's going to come in handy. Oh, not good. Damn it. Yeah. We're too encumbered to outrun her, so I just had to full on take her down. Okay, first order of business make a wrench. So let's grab these other mechanical parts the iron, the leather, and the duct tape. I think that's all we need. There we go. And then um, to make the workbench, we're going to need 20 mechanical parts plus another four to make another wrench. So basically we need 23 because we have an extra mechanical part right there. But that shouldn't be hard to get. You know, because we can just use the wrench to start wrenching cars and, th and stuff. Okay, good. Um, let's take a look at our food situation here. Unfortunately, we only have one egg, so we can't make bacon and eggs. But um, what I might actually do is let's drop a few things off, run back to the trader really quick, and just sell um, these items that I want to sell. And... The wrench should be done by then, and then we can hit a couple of cars and stuff on the way back. So let me just make sure. Let's see, we don't need to carry that with us. Uh, no, we want to sell those. These we can't sell for now. We have to wait till we have 10, so we'll just save these for the time being. Uh, we can put the brass in here. I'm going to put the coffee back in here for now, since we have the Mega Crush. And uh, we could get some more boiled water going, but let's let's eat these. This will get our um, hunger and thirst back up to, in you know, in good shape. I don't think it's going to fully get us back there, but it'll be, it'll be close. And then we can make four more um, boiled meat later if... We don't come across any more eggs for bacon and eggs. Just looking to see if there's anything else I want to sell right now. I don't think there is. Okay, let's put um, da, 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 these back down here. Okay, let's run over to the trader while we're waiting for the wrench. Make a little more coin and then start wrenching on the way back. It is almost nighttime, so we don't have a... A lot of time left here. Okay, so that gets us up to 2588. We've already looked at his food, right? Yeah. Um. Okay, yep, I think that's all we need from you for now, buddy. Did we check this trash? Oh, can't do that right. I wonder if this car is in range of his protection. Oh, that's cool how they come apart now. I like that. I'm not going to go after those cars because it's too close to nighttime. I'll, I'll just wrench my way back home. OK, 
Okay, let's make sure we have full stamina. Okay, something aggro's on us. But we're gonna finish out this car. The house is just right there. Oh, something aggro on us. Okay, let's go. It's okay. We can uh we can finish the rest out tomorrow. If we can get her to come over here, we can kill her. Oh, there's two of you. All right. You guys are just gonna <laughs> You're just gonna stand there and be stupid. Okay, have an arrow sandwich. We need to actually break this. So I can get some bleeds going on them. You're the more dangerous one because you're feral. Shit. Oh, she. Oh, I can't believe it. Oh, no. Oh, man. That is the worst luck ever. Son of a bitch. <laughs> I should have. As soon as she broke through, I should have just turned and ran because she's feral, you know? But I thought, no, I can take her. Oh, man. I can't believe that. I hope she's not still down there. That could be problematic. All right. Well, now we've got frickin' Grim Reaper to deal with. I don't hear anything. Yeah, I should have ran as soon as she broke through, but... I didn't, so there you go. That's too bad, but it is what it is. It is what it is. Okay, what I'm going to do is we're going to upgrade this. Uh, that was weird. It was upgrading and it wasn't animating. Okay. Well, at least we don't have a ton of Grim Reaper. A little bit, but... Oh, that sucks. Okay, let's see. Um, Let's grab this. And grab some of this uh, right here and go back down. Actually, you know what else, too? I want... Um, let's grab some of this, too. I'm going to put all of this stuff in there. We got 17 mechanical parts already, so we shouldn't have any trouble at all getting the rest of those. Let's stick you in there. What the hell, man? They're, it's not animating. <laughs> Does it... Uh, yeah, okay, we got a bug here. How about that? Um, yeah, we'll leave that the way it is, and then we can melee through here and still shoot uh, up that way. And as you can see, I've already upgraded these so I can fight zombies from there. Uh, I might have to re-log, because, yeah, the animations are not working right. Gotta love experimental, man. Okay, so let's see, where are we at? Let's assess the situation. I'm going to put some of these in here. I still want to keep some scrap iron, though, for other other stuff. We'll put those in there. We're doing pretty good overall, aside from the fact that I just bit the dust. <laughs> that sucks, man. Ah, okay, well, can't do anything about it except for move on, right? So, um, we're, we're actually in really good shape on food and drink, and I have the ability to make four more boiled meat as needed, so we're good there. Uh, we have 32. Let's, uh, let's actually cook up this water now. I don't have a ton of wood. Um, I want to... Oh, actually, no. You know what we're going to do with this water is we're going to make as much glue as we can. How much do I have now? Ten. Well, we got ten. That's not bad. We have ten glue and seven duct tape. Uh... No, I think I'm going to just turn all this into boiled water. If I did make glue, how much water would it consume? 18 of the 32. Um, yeah, what the hell, let's do it. And I'll still have 14 more water left over afterwards. Then we'll have the glue available to us uh, as needed. 
Um, so let's go fill these up. Whoops. Down in our little built-in watering hole right underneath the house. Oh, did it work? Okay, yeah. Yeah, the, the hand animations are all jacked up. It's the first time I've seen that bug in this in Alpha 20. Okay, so let's go here. Recipes, boiled water. And we need a total of six, about seven minutes of burn time for all that to finish. Very good. Okay, well, aside from our unfortunate little death there, um, which brings us up to a death count of three now, uh, we are otherwise doing pretty good, actually. So what I'm going to do, guys, is I'm going to... Uh, in the morning, I'm going to go out and get the rest of the mechanical parts that I need so I can get a workbench built up. And then we need to start thinking about what we're going to do for Horde Night 7 um, tomorrow uh, on day six and get that figured out okay so i think that's it for this episode hope you guys enjoyed the episode if you did please hit that like button and subscribe to the channel leave a comment share out the video and if a feral jumps through your window run like hell see you later bye